Baby Mac to me can be used for almost everything as long as I can get some regional supplementation. Remy Fennel 250 mics, it comes as either a 1 milligram or 2 milligram bottle. I put that in a 50 cc bottle of propofol. I infuse that at about 20 to 30 cc's an hour. I put a salter nasal cannula. We really don't have salters anymore. We have some generic brand now of nasal cannulas with the extra port in them. And what's the respiratory rate? Huge safety margin. Very easy to do. If I'm out there and we're doing a couple of hernias today, this is the simplest way. I actually can do four cases out of one $6 bottle of Remy Fentanyl. With generic propofol, we're talking about a $2 an hour anesthetic. You do the math for recovery of cost here. Pretty impressive. Medium Mac goes back and forth very quickly. Remy 0.5 to 1, same propofol bottle. Based it on 25 to 75 cc's, based this on stimulation. A lot of times I'll just slip a little LMA in these patients without actually inflating it. I just use it as an airway adjunct. If you really want to be slick, and I love doing these things, I put an old Jackson Reese system there, let the oxygen flow into it hooked up to my ventilator. I put an IMV of six on air, so if they're not breathing six, their ventilator will fire for them, and I just watch the Jackson Reese bag go up and down. I base this purely on stimulation. Big Mac is a general, that's what it is. One or two of Remy, 50 of Propofol. You need airway support. Oftentimes you need a little vent support. I do the exact same thing, except for this time when I slip the LMA and I actually inflate it. Most of the time the patients ventilate right through this. I gotta be honest, two times in, since 96 that I've actually paralyzed somebody in the office. 